Hi students, today we are going to see a new topic that is about signals and system subject. So today we will see the just intro about what is meant by signal. Uh, signal is an indication about which some amount of information is conveyed. For example, if you are waiting in the traf at the traffic signal, so what the traffic signal conveys when the traffic signal shows you the green light, it indicates that we can pass through that junction. If it shows the red light, we have to stop at that junction. So the that indication will give you some information. The color of that indication will give you some information that whether you have to stop or you have to move. That is a signal as an indication about which some amount of information is conveyed. Signal. Signals are mathematically represented as function of one or more independent variables. Signals are mathematically represented as function of one or more variables or independent variable that too. Suppose, for example, if you take a speech, so it is a one dimensional, that is in terms of time. If you take an image, image is a two dimensional. Suppose, a function represented by e x of t, that means it is depending on two variables, that is space and time. So, suppose if you take a TV picture, It is a three dimensional x, y, t. And there are different types of signals are there. Types of signals. Like we have three types of signals. One is continuous or analog signal and the second one is discrete signal and the third one is a digital signal and in between discrete and digital signal you will have a quantized signal quantized signal. So it will be in between discrete signal and digital signal. 